Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. My name is Belinda. In this channel, you will find easy and affordable do-it-yourself projects. Today's project will be these beautiful soap and lotion dispensers along with this wire caddy. Now, if you love farmhouse home decor, then I think you'll like this easy and affordable DIY. The cost for this was only $3 and everything was purchased at Dollar Tree. Before that we get started, I just want to ask if you can please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and also if you'll click that bell icon, you know, right there in the corner so that you can be notified every time that I upload a new video. So if you're ready, let's go ahead and get started. I'll be using these two white ceramic dispensers two silver pumps from other dispensers that I had from the Dollar Tree, one small wire basket. Dollar Tree carries two shapes, the round one and the oval one. I'll be using the oval one for this project. Some Mod Podge. And I created these labels on my computer, but you can also download some on Google. You can just search some labels and download them and then print them out. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is cut the labels and I'm going to start with the word soap. And I'm going to try to cut as close to the edge of the print as I possibly can. Next, I'm going to add some Mod Podge to the back of the label using my sponge brush. Then I'm going to carefully place the label over the ceramic container. And then I'll start to smooth it out with my fingers. Next, I'm going to brush on a thin layer of Mod Podge over the label, just like this. If you put too much Mod Podge, the ink might start to smear off. So that is the reason for the thin layer. Here I'm showing you that I have both labels on both dispensers. Now I'm going to put them aside and let the glue dry. Okay, so I want to show you one thing. Here is the basket with its original height. Now here I'm putting in the dispenser and as you can see that the height of the basket is too high for my dispenser. So what I want to do is cut it down. That way the word soap and lotion will be more visible. And also the dispensers will look nicer in the wire basket. Okay, so I started off with my wire cutters to get a very precise cut and then I'm going to proceed with just regular scissors. This is what I mean about precise. I want to cut just above the tip right there as I'm pointing it out to you. The reason that I'm doing that is because I want the edge to look the same all the way around. The great thing about these wire baskets is that they are very soft and pliable so scissors work great on them. Okay, once I'm done cutting, I'm just showing you here what a nice clean edge I have all the way around the basket. Okay, so what I'm going to do next is start to curve the edge. Now I'm going to be using this glue stick right here just so that it can be my guide. You don't have to use a glue stick, you can use a pencil, just anything that's round. Or you can just use your fingers just to curve the edges. And I'm going to continue going all the way around until I have the desired look that I'm looking for. I know that they have some really nice wire baskets out there, but I thought that making one for a dollar, you couldn't beat that. So that's why I made my own wire caddy basket. I'm not sure you can see, but I continue to slide the glue stick along the edge using it as my guide. And this is how the basket looks once I'm done with it. Next, I'm going to add the silver pumps to my dispensers. And this is how they turned out. I 
I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up and also share. I'd really appreciate it. You have yourself a blessed day. And remember, love, laugh, and create. Until my next video, bye-bye and God bless.